What is up, party people? Yeah. Thanks for coming back to another one of my videos. Um, if you're new and you haven't seen my videos before, my name is Jen. I'm a full-time reseller on eBay, Poshmark, and Mercari. Um, primarily, gosh dang it. <laughs> primarily selling clothing. Um, today I do have a Goodwill outlet or the bins haul for you. I got about 58 pounds of stuff. So, uh, if you like videos like this, don't forget to subscribe down below. Hit the like button if you liked it. Leave a comment if you want to. Yeah. Okay. Let's just get going. First off, I want to show you this one just because it's right on top. I was going to put it on, but I already washed it and I don't want to get my makeup on it but this is just a hat it says boy crazy on it um it is very flimsy <laughs> so we'll have to figure out to... anyway it has like this adjustable back it looks vintage to me embroidered boy crazy hat next I just have my stuff right here so if I get a little close I'm sorry this one has fuzzies. It's uh, wool rich, size, I don't know, I can't tell right now, extra large. Um, it's a full zip, or no, I lied. It's a half zip sweater that I got. I'm gonna throw those over there. Next on the thing, I decided that I'm gonna only pick up loft from the bins and if it's cute, um, just because it doesn't sell great, I want loft to be one of my bread and butter items. Um, but this is just a dress. It's a size small. It has a really pretty, like, floral type of pattern. Uh, yep, there's that one. This one was cool. I only picked it up um, based off of style. It is wet seal, size medium. And it's like a bomber jacket. And it has, like, these flowers on it. And I liked it. Oh, this is so funny. So I was really debating whether to pick this up or not. It looks like it's a, um, somebody wore this in a dance costume or like, a, you know, it's a leotard. But it's velvet and it has floral at the top. I'm gonna sell it as a bodysuit. And I would call it a size medium because it would fit me. Um... There is a little tag in here, I think, yeah, um, and it says, I don't know, that's what it says. <laughs> Woo, I almost dropped it. Okay, next. This is a Lush. I really don't like this brand. It doesn't sell well for me, but I got it from the bins. It's an extra small um, blouse. And I thought it was a decent looking blouse. Maybe somebody will put it in a bundle. If somebody has work, they could wear this to work. Anyway, I tried to look cool today with my jean jacket I just got. I needed a jean jacket in my wardrobe, so I got this one recently, and it's Gap. <laughs> okay, this was cool. Um, it's going to be hard to show you, but this is a Lululemon with the tag still attached, size 8. And this is a dress. It's a crissy, crossy, micro stripe. There's the label or the symbol there. And it has, I don't know, it, but it's a maxi dress. So that was cool to find that at the bins and it's in really great condition. I found some other Lululemon stuff that I don't even want to list because it was garbage. <laughs> But I was excited to find it, so I had to pick it up. Um, again, this is loft. This is a size small. And this is a really pretty dress with a keyhole back. And it cinches in at the waist. It's not really the season for this, but I'm grabbing stuff at the bins um, for all seasons. Just because you don't know when you're going to see it again. Um, I'll pick this up at the bins too. So this is Lauren Ralph Lauren size large. Look at these uh, little button details and it has metallic um, stripes on it. And this is just a dress. 
that I liked. So I got it. This one was interesting. Uh, what size? So this is Boohoo size US 12. I don't know if I want to keep picking this up because I keep picking it up and it's not selling. But it has a big cutout here, as you can see, with these grommets on the side. It'll look awesome for somebody who wants to wear this. I just really like the style, and so I picked it up. Oh, this was so cool. I love this. <laughs> so this is, um, again, it's Lauren Ralph Lauren. This is Lauren Jeans Co. Come on, focus. There you go, and it's a size 2X, and I love the pattern on this. Oh my gosh, so it's stripey, stripey, and it's, uh, it has a little peplum -y type of thing. I believe this is either a shirt or a tunic, um, just because it's not that long. But I love this. It's a little Henley style. Awesome. I love that. Oh, this is cool. <laughs> This is cool. So this is Jessica Howard, size 16. This is a um, like a a jacket, and it has um, some beading and some stonage on there. There's even some um, cute little seashell type things, and it's just a blazer thing. But it also came with a dress. A matching dress that has cute little details all over it too. Some of the threads are loose. It might be missing beads. I haven't looked into it. Um, but this is just a long black dress that goes with that. I can't leave this stuff behind. I, I don't know why, but somebody put a lot of effort into that. <laughs> okay, next up. <clears throat> um... What is this? This is new with tags. I've never heard of this. New Direction. It's a size medium. It's so soft. And I would keep it for myself. I'm actually going to if it doesn't sell. It's so soft. It's this plaid tunic and it has the... I forget what you call that. I think it's like, um... Penguin? No? I don't know. I don't know what that's called, but it's a tunic with these little butt flaps on it. All right, this is Gorge. This is called Shoreline. It's a free size, which, I mean, everything has a size. So I would call this a medium or a large. It has um, embroidery on the front, and it's like this tie-dye. I would call this um, a swimsuit cover-up, just because it is very see-through. But it's so pretty. I like it. Oh, this one surprised me. But I picked it up anyway. So it's just Target Exhilaration. This is a size medium. This dress is gorge. Look at this. I can't believe they sold this cute. I mean, I can, I guess. But I love this dress. It's so pretty. So I had to pick it up. I think it'll sell. This is awesome. So I'm getting into the prom dresses, apparently. This is... I have no idea. Lenovia, size medium, and it's another one of those. I just showed one of these. It's a one shoulder. This one has a lot going on here. Same color as the other one. Um, and then it has like this bubble hem at the bottom. So I like that. Yeah. This is a blazer by Classiques. On, I don't know how to say that. Size medium. And this is like a jean jacket blazer. And I like the style of it. I might. No, I'm not going to keep it. I'm not going to keep it. It'll go for sale. This is another awesome find. I think it's a swimsuit cover. I'm not sure. It's called Pineapple Moon. And it's a size medium. And it's a little dress. And it says uh, stuff on it. I don't know. Some of the stuff I can't pronounce. Like it's a different language. Like uh, that. 
something about fruit, I think. Anyway, I like it. It's darling. I bought it. This is not a brand you want to go run out and pick up, but um, it's Forever 21, size US medium, and it's Forever 21 Los Angeles. I don't know, but it's really cute, like boho style dress. And I liked what it had going on for it, so I'll sell it for like 10 or 15 bucks. That's fine with me. I'm getting real close. Next up, we have a loft size medium. This is a, ooh, that kind of made me dizzy. Um, this is a long sleeve blouse, uh, really cute. And then it has two little buttons on the back that get stuck in your hair when you wear it. Oh, and speaking of getting stuck in your hair, this next one has a cute little button on it, on the back. And I had to rip some poor girl's hair out of the button. There's still hair there, but... <laughs> uh, yeah. Anyway, this is Disney store size 7, 8. This is a dress. Um, and it has cute little mini on the bottom with some flowers and polka dots. I can pass this up. I didn't realize that it had hair in the button until I got home. Look at it, she's got little uh, rhinestones. So cute. Um, so hopefully we're all right. Um, this, I haven't heard of this brand. It's a size extra large. It's called Mat, Ma I don't know, Mata Traders, size extra large. It's a chambray embroidered, um, kind of like a fit and flare style dress. I just like the embroidery and the chambray color. And it has the embroidery there. Ooh, it has pockets. Yes. So I'm going to have to ooh, look that one up. And this one is interesting. So this one's tag is missing, but I knew... And it doesn't have an inside tag either, but I knew it was something. Look at this cool, cool blazer. So I picked it up and I did some research when I got home. It is a free people blazer. And size, I don't know, small or medium, but I love this patchwork on it. And uh, I'm just gonna have to measure it and tell you later. This is a $10 sale, so it's uh, Old Navy, size extra large, spaghetti strap dress, but it has this cute little, it's very minor, but this little peekaboo see-through part. And it's a floral dress, and this would be great for this time of year for um, layering, just because it's not super like spring and summer floral. Um, okay. This one I don't pick up either, but I love this. So this is Liz Claiborne, size 16, yep. And it has this little detail, another chambray deal. And at the bottom it has that same detail. So I really like this dress. It was good. It was a good pickup. All right. This one is a Boston Proper size extra small and it's a gray sweater with like this lace overlay on the front really pretty it feels real comfy too nice this one is a torrid size 3 they have vanity sizing so I think this is 3x um, it's a um, like a olive green uh, kind of like a cheetah print with pockets on the front, shirt, if I'm giving it any justice. Torrid does great for me. I always sell everything that I buy of Torrid. Um, I just like that. Oh, these were super cool. So this is Brooks and Dunn for Panhandle Slim, size extra large. Look at how cool this, this shirt is. So it's a button down shirt. It feels like linen blend, maybe cotton linen. Nope. 100% cotton, but it's very light, lightweight cotton. Uh, buttons all the way down, sleeveless, and then I found this one too. Oh, well, I found another one. Uh, this is J. Jill, um, size 1X, and I'm trying to stay away from J. Jill, but you can't when 
this is at the bins. It's so soft. It's a um, plaid. I am like fumbling with my words today. I'm sorry. I think I woke up with strep throat today. We're working through it. But I just love this. I couldn't leave it there. I haven't heard of this brand, um, but it is new with tags. It's called Camp David Size Large. I almost I threw the tag at you. Sorry about that. Um, and it's a hoodie. And it has an anchor on it. I haven't done any research on this one yet. Um, but we'll see. Camp David hoodie. New with tags. Alright, this is one bad A shirt. So this is Roper. This is a size 15, 16. Yep. And it's freaking awesome, you guys. And if you look close, the button, do you see how it... Here, let me put that on my head. How it zigzags like that. That's where the buttons are. So if you unbutton it, it's still going to have that zigzag on the shirt. But anyway, I really like these kind of shirts. I think they're awesome. This, I wasn't sure. I see this from time to time. And I don't think this is what I think it is, but I thought I'd pick it up. It's called Velvet. Um, to remind myself to look it up. This is a dress. Um, it's uh, tiered and pleated. And it's really good quality. I love this greenish color. It is coming up true to color on the camera. I love this greenish color. Um, it doesn't have a size right there. Let's check inside. Mmm, I see a tag. Alright, it's a size large, 100% micromodal. So it's soft, obviously. Um, but yeah, so I'm going to look that up and see how it does. <laughs> Sorry, I keep getting close. This is another loft. Uh, this is a size extra small. It has really cute beading on the neckline. That's why I got it. And it's another chambray dress with a cute little beading. All right. <clears throat> this is just Charlotte Russe. I don't, I don't really know why I picked it up other than because it's cute. And it's an extra small and it's a, another dress. It's like caged neckline, green, uh, crinkly fabric dress. And then the back is strappy as well. La 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 la. Okay, this one I got home and realized there's a flaw in it. Um, it's Pendleton size large. I might keep it. There's a flaw right there. It's a hole. Mm. But it's um, a turtleneck sweater. Oh, I just love this. I kind of want to wear it to the holiday party, you know, to the holiday. Yeah. This one's Banana Republic, size small, another bread and butter brand. Um, this feels like silk or polyester. Let's look. 100% silk, yeah. So a silk top, paisley kind of. <clears throat> Sorry, I keep clearing my throat. I have sore throat. All right, okay, here's the other one. So here's the Brooks and Dunn Can Handle Slim. This one's a size medium. It's Pearl Snap. I believe this one's women's. Um, and it's Paisley print. Paisley plaid print. Ooh, that was hard to say. And then it has, you, I don't know if you can tell. Yeah, you can. So it has like this little outline stuff on the back. Anyway. It's nice. Um, and I figured I'd get it. I don't know what brand this is, um, but it's called By Taylor, made in the USA. It's a size small, medium, and it's, um, I don't know if it was made to look old or if it's just old, but this is a sweater with a drawstring at the bottom. Cool flower on the front. I like that. This one's Soprano. I believe this is sold at Nordstrom or Nordstrom Rack, but it's just a striped ombre kind of effect maxi dress. 
Um, I got it because I do see Soprano quite a bit and I wanted to remind myself to look it up to see if I should be picking it up or not. <clears throat> okay, this one is... This one's an H&M size US 12 and this is just a dress but I love the print on it kind of leaf print um, and it, does it have pockets no pockets on this one unfortunately but I like the print again this is a 10 15 maybe dollar sale and then I saw this one I was surprised nobody grabbed it because I don't usually go into the bins like right when they roll them out I'm like Burr. I usually don't but this is, um, I looked it up, I think it's um, Anthro brand, Vanessa Virginia, it's a size US 4, and it's got like these little tigers on it, this tiger print top, oops, I liked it, I'm surprised nobody grabbed that. This one, I, mm, it might be Anthro brand. It might be Urban Outfitters. Let me look. No, it's not. It doesn't have the RN. Hmm. I wonder what this is. I don't, I don't know. Listicle, I think is what it says. Size medium. And it's a sweater. It's a really, uh, medium. Well, it's kind of heavy, heavy knit sweater. I really like it. So if it's a nothing brand, I'm probably going to keep it. But, so there's that sweater. This one's another loft. This is size extra large. And this is just a polka dot uh, see-through shirt. Oh, it has a little tie thing in the front. How cute. I really like this one. I don't know. I've never found this brand before. I think it's, I don't know, C seal? Maybe? I don't know. Size large. This is a cheetah print jacket. Peplumy bottom. It's gorgeous. Hopefully it sells well. Okay, next up. This is a cachet extra small dress. I really like the pattern on it and it's very fitted. The back is, uh, it has like these pleats or whatever. It's not a pleat, but it makes it so it's fitted. There is some loose strings right here that I'll just trim off, um, but I liked it. What was this? Oh, I think this is Paper Crane, I think. I lost you at some point. Hopefully we're on this. Um, I'm not even going to try to say that, um, but I think it's by Paper Crane. I'll have to look it up. It's a size large and it's this cowl neck, kind of like a casual style dress, tunic with pockets, pockets, knitted style. This one I realized when I got home that there's something wrong with it. So it is Torrid, <clears throat> excuse me, size one, new with tags for $74. However, it's new with defects because this doesn't really work. Dang it. But I'm still going to list it. Hopefully somebody wants it still. So we'll see. Oops. Here's another loft. This one's a size small blouse. It's uh, fully like, uh, I don't know if that's embroidered. No, it's not. But I really like the pattern on there. And I'm only going to pick up loft if I like the pattern on it. So there's that one. I originally got this one for me, um, but I think I'm just going to sell it. I don't know what brand. Fifth Sun, size medium. But it says Girl Power on it. And it's a tank top with uh, long armpit holes. <laughs> All right, next. This is a Lucky brand, 
size small. I am going to be more picky with the Lucky brand that I get. I did get this one because it is a cardigan um, from the bins and it has pockets and it was in really great shape. Um, usually the Lucky brand that I find at the bins nowadays has holes and stuff in it. Um, so I looked over that one really well and uh, it was good. <clears throat> All right, this one is a no brand, but it's size small and it's a dress. It's just a black maxi dress, but at the bottom of it here, let me, there we go. At the bottom of it, it's embroidered with all these polka dots and this cool little strip of awesomeness. So I liked it, so I picked it up. I don't know what this is. This brand. Uh, Rave? I don't know. Size medium, but I did like the style of this. So, uh, let me figure it out first. Okay. Here we go. So it's a, a gray dress, and it has these cute little rufflies on the bottom. Um, the tool has polka dots in it, and then the back of it has, here, let me try and turn it around nicely. There we go. Has this cool detail for your back. So yeah, I picked that one up. This one was inside out, and I didn't look through it, and it has a flaw. Well, it has a stain on it. I'm going to try and get it out. This is just We the Free. It's a Henley from free people and it has a stain where was it? I just saw it maybe it was the other one because I got two one of them didn't have a stain one of them did so maybe it was the other one here we go with the boohoo again I said I wouldn't pick up so here's boohoo this is a size 6 but it's a Peter Pan collar I realized when I re-watched my last video that I called that a peplum collar. Such a dork. Chevron print shirt with a keyhole back. This shirt I picked up because I love it. Um, it's not necessarily any cool brand or anything size large, but it's a floral vintage shirt. And then this one I don't really know why I got it. I don't know this show or this movie or I don't even, you know, it's Doctor Who. <clears throat> I don't watch it, um, but it's a size large Doctor Who shirt. This one I love. I don't know what this brand is. At last in company. Size medium. It's a corduroy jacket and I would keep it if it was a size, size large or extra large. Um, it's this really cool purpley blue color. Gosh, I love this. And it buttons down the front. It's awesome. Okay, now we're getting into bottoms, but first let me show you this scarf. Um, it's funny because I grabbed this scarf because I recognized this brand. I don't know how to say it or what it's called, but I bought a shirt from the bins from this brand and the, um fabric tag said oil silk. I don't really know what that is, but I love the shirt and I love the scarf. So I got it. Oh, I think, yeah. So now we're into bottoms. Um, this is halogen size 16. Um, it's kind of like a checkered skirt and it's really soft, really soft. I like it. Okay, next up. Um, this is Citizens of Humanity. What is that? Danny Crop Straight Leggin? Or no, just leg. And there you go. Nice little medium wash. There's the butt. Oh, the size is 28. My camera turned itself off. Um, but these are Seven for all mankind men's jeans, size 31. Mm, they've got the button fly there. I was trying to see if it had like a name on it. It just says standard, but they're gray wash 
straight leg jean. The bottoms didn't look like they were worn at all. Really great shape, so I picked those up. I'm trying to expand my men's closet because I have a 3 for 30 sale going on in my Poshmark closet. And the only ones that have sold 3 for 30 are men's stuff. So this was probably handmade. It doesn't have any tags in it. This is a skirt. Look at how amazing this is. This is a size 4, 6. Oh my gosh. And it's a wrap skirt. So it buttons here. And then on the inside, um, it has, it's on this side, uh, clasp like work pants have. So it clasps on this side and then wraps around and buttons on that side. I freaking love this. And this is probably going to sell on Mercari. Um, I have a more curated closet in Mercari that holds that kind of stuff. And like this, I'll put this on Mercari as well. It's new without tag, new with button. It's a Eddie Bauer size six corduroy maxi skirt, floral. I love this. I love this too. So I do cross post everything on Poshmark um, that's on Mercari, but I just want people to come back and buy my stuff again. So this is just candies, size seven, so it's Kohl's. But it's this awesome corduroy skirt. Oh, it's, I don't, no. No. It's not giving it any justice. It is so cool. It's like kind of velvet corduroy. And when you tilt it like this, you can kind of see right here that it has a white underlayment type of thing in the corduroy. I don't know. I just really love this. And it's awesome. I don't know this brand either. Joy Jean, size small. This is just a skirt, a jean mini skirt. Doesn't look like anything, but when you turn it around, you get this butterfly there. And the butterfly butt, I love this. This again will go in my Mercari. All of the studs seem to be there. I didn't look at it until just now, but really funky, cool skirt. And then we go back to a basic skirt. So this is just H&M US size 8. And this is just a large hound tooth print skirt for work. Oh, I love this too. This is 35th and 10th is what it says. And then it's a size medium skirt. And it buttons down the front. And it feels like silk. It's definitely it's rayon acetate it's vintage did i even show you the tag i think anyway and it's beautiful 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 skirt i love that all right next skirt oh i don't i don't know what this is snow skin size extra large i got it for to look up but it has a little shimmy shimmy shake shake at the bottom and then I have a couple pairs of shoes then I want to show you some stuff that I've washed already and in the wash they got damaged so anyway here's um, some cowboy boots this one does have a little bit of wear here if you can see that these are called Dan post and they're a size seven and a half M I love these boots. The bottoms are still in good shape. Here's the damp post, if you can see that. And um, this one has a little bit more wear here. Um, but that's the boots that I got. And then one more pair of shoes. These are Cole Hans. There you go, Cole Han. Ew. It's kind of, it's shaped weird, so I'm going to have to reshape it. Um, shoes, they're a size men's 9.5 M. Alright, let me show you. I got cut off again. My camera keeps dying. So I'm really quickly going to go through the stuff that has damage that I'm going to try and fix. This one I actually bought knowing that it has damage. Um, but it's a Nike 
extra large New York Giants uh, coat. Oh, it's Yankees, <laughs> Giants, <laughs> whatever. So what's on here is a little bit of pink right here. And then also when I bought it, it had some stains on this back part, but the stains actually came out on that. So I'm gonna treat the pink one more time, give her a wash and see how she does. Um, really good bins fine, in my opinion. I think this is the culprit that stained up all the other crap that I washed. But this is another Ralph Lauren dress, size large. It's very, like, it reminds me of somebody wearing this on a boat. Um, but it's a maxi dress. I feel like there's something interesting on it somewhere. No? Oh, there it is. That's the interesting piece right there on the arm. And it's just a cotton maxi dress. So there's that. This one has, I think it had some bleeding or something on the white part. Oh no, it's not bleeding, it's just dirty. So I'm going to stain treat that and see if I can get it out. Here's the other free people that got messed up. So these don't have size tags, but it's whatever. Um, the free people, see look at all of that blue stuff. Ugh. So I'm going to try and stain treat that. These ones I did notice that they had a stain on it at the bins. There's a stain right there. But it's my first time finding this brand, so I justified it, I guess. It's a junk food size large. They're little capri pants. Um, it says Sergeant Pepper right there. And on the butt it says, peace, love. And the Beatles. <laughs> I like that. So I'm going to try and get it off. Um, it is on the front side right here. So I'm going to try and get that off. And then this one for sure I know was perfect. Or else I wouldn't have picked it up. But this is a Chico's 100% uh, linen size 2. Which I, I don't know what size that is. But this picked up a lot of that blue stuff in the wash. So there's that. Um, it's on the back too. It's unfortunate. I'm going to try and get it to work for me, but this is just a Chico's jacket. I don't know if I even said that. I was just pointing out the stains. Tie waist. This is super cool. Orange color. But that's it. My camera keeps dying, so we'll keep the outro short and sweet. Thank you so much for watching. If you made it through all the way to the end, I really appreciate it. You guys are awesome. You guys are my people. I love you. Until my next video, stay weird.